so guys, welcome to Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening. Um, we've been waiting on this game. It's finally here. We're excited to play it. Uh, I have never actually played this game, ever, even the original version. So what I'm going to need from you all is some help. If I get stuck, if there's one thing I know about old Zelda games is that there's like zero hand-holding. So it's easy to get stuck, it's easy to get lost and not know where to go next. So. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna need your guys' help. So, I love you all. Thank you for all the support you've dropped on this channel so far. I don't want to watch this again. Is it gonna show us again? It is. So, anyway, um, yeah, thank you for all the support on this channel so far. Uh, without further ado, smash that like button if you want to see more episodes in this series. Subscribe if you're new. Without further ado, let's get this. Alright, we want nor- I want to play normal. Per usual. Let's just go with Link. I'm really excited. Apparently this game is kind of a one-for-one -one copy of the original. What a relief. I thought you'd never wake up. You were tossing and turning. What? Zelda? No, my name's Marin. You must still be feeling a little woozy. You are on Koholint Island. Yeah, so this game is a step away from the whole Zelda stuff, apparently. Sweet. Obviously, I'm on the Nintendo Switch playing with the Pro Controller here. Alright, your current strength won't cut it. Alright, let's talk to her. Follow the lane south to reach the beach where I found you. Since you watched the shore, lots of nasty monsters have been in the area, so be careful, okay? <clears throat> this is Marin, or this is Terran, her dad. Well, Link, you finally snapped out of it. Name's Terran. Hope you're feeling better. What? How did you know your name? How did I know your name? You think it's weird, eh? Well, I saw it back on the back of this shield. So Sweet. You got your shield back. Hold R to repel enemies with it. Cool. Nice. Love a good parry. So I guess we'll go down to the beach here and see what we can find. I'm really excited to play this. Um, I have Breath of the Wild. I uh, I enjoyed it at first, but it got a little too overwhelming. So I'm kind of hoping this will rein it in a little bit, which is kind of what I've heard. Um, the map itself in this game is not huge. Oh my gosh! I oh boy, I am loving this. What's up, guys? You hear that when you're running out of hearts, you better go find a big fairy. Why? I have no idea. I'm just a kid. Kiddo. Love that. Excuse me. Kiddo is what my wife calls kids. What does this say? Tail Cave, Taranbo Shores. Sure. Alright. Can I, like, shake a tree or anything like that? No. Alright, we're down here. Oh boy. I'm just trying to dodge these guys right now. I thought he was going to get me. Oh gosh. Maybe I shouldn't be down here? I don't know. I feel like this is not where I need to be at this time. <laughs> so I'm trying to... Um, I'm aiming to make these episodes about 20 minutes each. I've kind of found that the shorter episodes on this channel do a little bit better. So that's sort of my goal anyway. I kind of want to go down these holes, but at the same time, not. <laughs> uh... Oh! At this point in time, just trying to find the beach that she mentioned. Huh, a keyhole here. It says tail keyhole. Okay. So both R1 and ZR can shield. Nice. Just wanted to try it out. Oh, crap. I honestly have no idea where I'm supposed to go. First of all, I'm trying not to die, which may very well happen. <clears throat> Let's go back up over this way. Oop. Only have one and a half hearts left. <laughs> What do you have for me? Suni? Hey man, when you want to save, hit up the system screen. You get there by opening the subscreen with plus and pressing R to get to the system screen. Don't ask me what that means, I'm just a kid. 
You guys are pretty smart. Just be kids. Let's check this out, by the way. Alright. So obviously we don't have anything yet, but... Okay, here we go. So I should... I should go down here. I just gotta figure out... Maybe I should just kind of explore around for now. You know? I'm a little foxy. Here sleeps the flying rooster. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> what? Get throw chickens. That's fun. Let's go in here. Okay, so I can buy some hearts. I obviously can't afford anything right now. Shopkeeper, hey, welcome. See something you like? Just bring it here. All right. Uh, I don't have any rupees, and I can't. Yeah, I can't. I can't lift those yet. So I'm guessing I need a sword, which I think is on the shore, actually. Hmm. I kind of just want to explore around a bit. Well, it seems that you're after that after you save, you will start at the last place you save, unless it's a dungeon where you start at the entrance. I'm not really sure why that is, because I'm just a kid. <laughs> I think I'm uh, finding out a theme here. These guys look pretty normal. This is a stand for something that says boo. Okay, yep, those are my boys. I'm Papal. Please to meet ya. I'll be lost in the hills later, so keep a lookout for me, here. With four boys who look alike, even I get confused sometimes. By the way, my baby wants a Yoshi doll. <laughs> I saw one at the Trendy Game, but I couldn't get it. Okay, so maybe that's sort of a little side mission I can go on. Try to get that Yoshi doll for him. We shall see. Uh, maybe we hit a... So we already went in there. Maybe we go into this place. They're kind of informing me on what to do, which is kind of nice. I kind of like the way they're doing that, actually. Oh, this is where I came from. Follow the lane south to reach the beach. Okay. Alright, so that's... Cool. So that's the house where I'm staying, I guess. Um... Let's, uh... What do you have to say? Alright. Can I go in your house? I love the art style. A lot of people were upset with how Link looks, but I don't know. I kind of like it. At least it fits the rest of the art, you know? How to say, please call outside. It seems that old man, old Rira, is a shy guy in person. Okay. So I really want to try to get south um, to get my sword or whatever. I'm guessing that's where you get your sword, because that's what I saw in the preview. I don't know. So I have to call him? <laughs> Alright, ask me anything about the island. If you get lost, give me a call. You know, there's a library in the village that might have some good information for you. Talk to you later. Um... Okay. So this is cool. I guess I can come here if I'm ever stuck. If I'm ever unsure what I'm supposed to do next, maybe. I can't get in there. So I think that looks like a game. Like a arcade game in there. Kind of like claw machine. So maybe that's where I get the Yoshi. <clears throat> I want to try and... Can I go in here? Nice. Hi. <laughs> My Bow Wow is so proud of his fine fur coat. Okay. Well, I don't want to get hurt by your Bow Wow, so... Oh boy! We're good. Oh, I haven't got him here yet. Is this the library, maybe? Indeed. Maps and memories... Secrets of the Whirling Blade. How to handle your shield like a pro. Sure. If you hold R, you can defend yourself. You can push enemies too. Interesting. Besides the standard shield, there's also a mirrored variety that can reflect beams. That's cool. Dark secrets and mysteries. I'm definitely going to come back here. 
looking at? Uh, sure, let's look at the map. Wow. Okay, so it's a bigger map than I thought. So I'm definitely going down the Taranbo shores. Properties of what? Read this book. Oh. You know what? That shield book actually taught me something. So I'm gonna go down here, and I'm gonna use my shield to try and push those spiky dudes. I feel like that's... That's the name of the game right now. So let's try that. So like... Yeah! Sweet! Nice! Oh gosh. Really close to dying, so I gotta be really careful here. Here we go! Oh, what's this guy? Hoot hoot! So you were the lad who owns the sword. Now I understand why the monsters are starting to act so violently. The courageous lad has come to wake the wi the, wi the wind fish. It is said that you cannot leave the island unless you wake the wind fish. Okay. You should now go north to the mysterious forest. I will wait for you there. Hoot. Thanks, dog. Appreciate it. Do I get the sword now? Sure enough. You found your sword. It must be yours because it has your name engraved on it. You can swim with B to attack enemies in the path. Nice. Okay. Ooh, yeah, I do need some, some health, so. I don't know what to do with these. Nice. Oh boy. Oh, do those guys just keep coming back? Or maybe they just last once? I'm not sure. Oh my gosh, I'm loving this. Whoa! Okay. I'm guessing those hurt me. Nice! What's in here? Who are you? Sale. Welcome to Sale's house. Oh, bananas. I'm Sale, and this is my house. House of bananas, I get it. <laughs> Actually, my hobby is collecting rare and unusual canned food. My brother is an artist, so I guess strange hobbies are in the family. That's not strange. Alright, can I smash it? I cannot. What, um... What are you doing here? So I remember in college I used to, um, I played some Zelda game, I don't remember which one it was, and it, I definitely didn't play it for long, but it was one of the older, it was one of the older, like, Game Boy or SNES ones, could have been a link to the past or something, or maybe it was, hmm, I'm not sure, but I know that game, I had the hardest time with it. And something I'm excited about in this game is, apparently, um, you know in the old game you'd have to switch, so like if you were using a bomb, you couldn't use your sword, and vice versa, and, well in this game, because there are obviously more buttons on the switch, you can map out all of your sort of tools and weapons and things to various buttons, so, can I push this rock? No, I have to come back to that. But, anyway, that's the only Zelda game I really played of this nature, and then, of course, on this channel, I, um, with a Nintendo Online, I played, uh, A Link to the Past. What, what is, this one is Link's Awakening. I played A Link to the Past, which is now on the Nintendo Online, so, and that was fun. I just did one episode. If you want to check that out, you can go check it out on my profile, my channel, I guess I should say. Oh. Still gonna hang out the controls here. It's a little interesting. I've been playing a lot of Blasphemous, so things are like super timed and things like that. Uh, which that game is amazing, by the way. If you haven't heard of it or checked it out yet, I recommend it. All right, feeling pretty good. Okay, so now I can hit those guys. Where the sea urchins don't touch them. Okay. All right, let's um. Let's go back up, explore, and see if we've missed any any buildings or anything we'd like to explore. I wonder if there's a... Okay, so hitting that is the map. 
Ooh, let's go to this game. See if we can win the Yoshi for that kid. That'll be the last thing we'll do this episode, and then, uh... We can hop into episode two. I might do uh, a few episodes at once. It's just sort of easier to record that way and get into the feel of the game, but not having to quit right after. Kind of get warmed up, if that makes sense. <laughs> uh, I think I need to keep going up, actually. Let's see if I can find my way. I love this art style, though. <laughs> It's so great. I mean, it feels like a brand new game. Like, it doesn't feel like this is an old game that was redone. Hmm. All right, let's come over here. Can I? Yeah, nice. All right, let's see if this is where the game is. Indeed. How does it work? Play. Turn to game. Uh, sure. No buttons move the crane. The rest is just timing. Okay. Um, alright. X move forward, A move right. Oh, what? Oh, I see. All right, let me, I'm gonna go get more rupees. I'll come back and try this again. I just need three more. I let go of X and I guess you just have to hold it down. Yeah, I don't have enough. All right, I'll be right back, dude. Don't you worry. Please. Oh, what? <laughs> it's like an actual game. I found a secret seashell, but what do you do with it? That's a great question. Maybe? Come on, let's go. Got him. I feel like this is really similar to the actual game. Yeah, look at that. Oh my gosh. Are you serious? No way. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> it took me like four tries. <laughs> I wanted to get something done this episode, you know? All right, let's take it over to him. All right, I guess I'll take it to the mom, maybe. Well, I'll take it to her then. That's not the right way. <laughs> Where is this place? Do you guys remember? Uh, I think it's up. Maybe. Oh, here it is. I think it's this house. No, that's the old man's house. Hmm. Where is your house, young one? Is it this one? No. Ah, <laughs> oh, here we go. This is the one. I remember it had two doors on it. Here you go, miss. Absolutely. Oh, I got a bow tie? Traded Yoshi doll for a ribbon. Maybe you can trade the ribbon for something else. Okay, cool. So trading is a thing in this game. Uh, great. Well, I uh, set out to do something this episode, and we accomplished it. So thanks, guys, so much for watching. Smash that like button if you want to see more episodes. I uh, really appreciate any and all support you drop on this episode, this series. I'm really excited to play this game with you all. So thanks so much for watching. As always, guys, I will see you when I see you. Take it easy.